Hey guys, Ru here with Not Avid for Blender. This one's gonna be about uh, fixing an interesting issue that you might run into. I'm actually uh, working on um, a sci fi weapon, and there is a bit of geo missing, and I need to rebuild it, but I need to rebuild it at a specific angle following the flow. So, in Vanilla Blender, it's not impossible, but it's a bit of a bitch. So, I'm gonna show you actually an easy way. Uh, to do it. So uh, what you need to do is install machine tools, which is a free add-on and remember to enable uh, to So many people message me about this um, Enable all the options of the machine tools. So when you go here to machine tools then make sure that ena you enable whatever you need Because for some fucked up reason it just comes without these you know everything is turned off and the people message me ask me hey you know, align tool doesn't work, you know, clean mesh doesn't work, you just gotta enable it, so there you go. Anyway, so what you need to do, right, is enable, I think it's called vert, I forgot what it's name, um, wait a minute, um, was it vert tool or something, what was it called again? Uh, object axis, object quick geometry, smart vert, sm I think it's called smart vert or something like that. Smart face creation, that's the one. So, um, it's really easy to use because what you need to do is find a corner, right, that is connected to the main geo. Click on it and press 4. And it's going to rebuild uh, at a specific angle, which is genius. Now, the, click this vert, GG, slide it up, right? So, GG, slide it up, click here, fall, and you're done. And this whole piece is rebuilt. Now, this one is also tricky, right? But we can do the same thing. So, 4-4, four, four, and then 4, and then you need to, you know, to kind of watch this angle here a bit. And we're going to probably have to fix it just a little bit. So, for this purpose, what we could use, right, is mirror tools. Because um, mirror tools are probably going to be able to fix this nicely. So, what I would do is select all these, right? And then go to my end panel and go to mirror and go for curve stretch. Uh, and curve stretch and then I need to select a uh, number of points uh, let me see one more time here select these right and curve stretch and then you can select with your mouse number of points I'm gonna choose four and then you can just simply you know readjust them to fix the flow uh, you can choose as many points as you need you can eyeball it uh, you can just, you know, also align it to a side view with hard ups if you wanted to, but, and press enter, uh, I think, on oh no, a right click, sorry, right click, right, to confirm. And we can do the same thing here because it's a bit wonky, right, so it's going to navigate to this view and, you know, grab these verts from, maybe from here, up to here, and kind of stretch, four is fine, and let's just, you know, fix this mess here, so it's a bit, you know, the flow is a bit bad, right. There you go, and right click, and then just click on this vert four and combine these two, and you're done, right? So you know um, this is the the way to fix issues like this. And if you really want to make it, you know, perfect, you will need to work this uh, a little bit. So probably work a bit on the vert sliding and kind of fix this curvature here. But like I said, you could use you know, tools like Mira Tools, which is great. So, yeah, anyway, guys, that's a quick video from me. Hope you enjoyed it. Give us a like and sub if you did. Both add-ons, Mira Tools and uh, Machine Tools are free, so go ahead and grab them. A uh, link to Machine Tools is in the video description, and Mira Tools you can get from GitHub. Thanks for watching. Catch you next one.